Jamaican uh, batsman John Campbell has earned a recall to the West Indies Test squad for the three-match series coming up against England next month in Barbados. Renato Brown tells us more. It's been 326 days since John Campbell last featured for the West Indies in a test. And by the time the first ball is bowled in Antigua on March 8, 340 days would have elapsed since the Jamaican played at the highest level in cricket. It is already a second coming for Campbell, who made his test debut in 2019. And luckily for him, it will be against the same team, albeit at a different venue three years later. The 28-year-old gets the nod ahead of Jeremy Solazano, who despite making a test debut against Sri Lanka last year, is yet to face a delivery at that level after he was hit on the helmet at short leg on the first morning of the first test, which resulted in him missing the rest of the series. Campbell's recall comes after a good start to the CWI Regional 4-Day Championship with the Jamaica Scorpions, where he scored 213 runs at an average of 53.25 in two games, including 127 against Barbados Pride. But with scores of 25, 45 and 16 in his next three innings in the competition, is Campbell's selection justified? I think we have stick with um, with Campbell uh, not only because that he's got the the hundred, but talking to the captain and the, and 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 battling with Campbell in the games that he has played, you know, we had a bit of success there. It was a bit um, unfortunate for for Jeremy, you know, but we decided to look, you know, we put him in the presence eleven game. Where is that? You know, the selectors can have a, a, another look at him because, as you know, it was a bit unfortunate after getting struck on the head that he didn't get a chance to play in Sri Lanka. Meanwhile, the West Indies selectors have also given a maiden test call-up to fast bowler Anderson Philip, who has so far taken 12 wickets in two first-class games at an average of 14.25 per wicket, with best figures of 5 for 82 against the Scorpions. Ross and Chase, Rakeem Cornwall, Shea Hope and Jamal Warkan are the other players to miss out from the last test series against Sri Lanka, while Shannon Gabriel misses out because of a hamstring injury. The full squad reads Craig Brathwaite, Captain, Jermaine Blackwood, Vice-Captain, Nkrumah Bonham, Shamar Brooks, John Campbell, Joshua Da Silva, Jason Holder, Alzar Joseph, Kyle Mears, Virsame Permal, Anderson Philip, Kimar Roach and Jaden Seals. The West Indies squad will assemble in Antigua from February 25 for training camp ahead of the Apex Test Series. Renardo Brown for TVJ Sports.